What's up, Crusaders? My name is Xavier. And my name is Aaron. And you're watching HC News. Grade 12s, grad cruise tickets are limited. Get your tickets fast. One ticket is $65, which includes a cruise ride across downtown, pizza, free non-alcoholic beverages from the bar, and security. To get a ticket, if you're paying cash, direct yourselves to Angel Santos, Sophia Thompson, Isha D'Souza, or Daniel Arsenal. And if you're planning on e-transferring, please directly talk to Ethan Nagra or contact the Grad Cruise Instagram at hcgradcruise2024. Thanks to all those who applied to be a grade representative this year. The votes are in, and SLT would like to congratulate Brooklyn Jasmines and Caitlin Dindler as our grade 9 reps, Melody Hossein and Oliver Tan as our grade 10 reps, and Janelle Cruz, Julian Salvador, and Zachary Lopez as our grade 11 reps. If you did not make the team this year, there will be a chance to join SLT next year. Grade 8s, check your emails to vote for your Grade 8 representative. Next week on the 26th, SEMA will have their first Eucharistic Adoration of the Year. It will be held at St. Matthew's Church from 3 to 3.45 p.m. There will also be a social after the Eucharistic Adoration from 4 to 4.45 p.m. Aaron, craving some sweets? Yes, please. The Holy Cross cheer team will have their bake sale on Monday, October 30th at lunch in the cafeteria. The Holy Cross dance team has opened an Instagram. Go check them out at Dance Crusaders. And now, here's a new episode of This Week at HD Sports. Hey Crusaders, welcome back to This Week at HD Sports. We have a busy week ahead of us, but before that, here are the accomplishments from last week. Congratulations to the JV Volleyball team for winning their games against EMS and Salish. To the Senior Volleyball team for winning their game against McMath, three sets to one. To the Junior Football boys for winning their game against Abbotsford, 49-0. To those who participated in the cross-country league race last Wednesday that took place at Fleetwood Park, and congratulations to the Grade 8 Girls Black and Red Volleyball team for winning their game against Elgin and Pacific Academy. Here are the results of the Senior Boys Football game against Abbotsford that took place on Friday, October 20th. Congratulations, congratulations to, to our, our Senior, senior Volleyball, volleyball Girls! <laughs> congratulations, congratulations to our Senior Volleyball, volleyball girls, girls for being first in the Double A Division in BC, BC for three consecutive <laughs> weeks in a row! <laughs> Now on to the schedule for this week. On Tuesday, October 24th, the cross country team will head to South Fraser's at Crescent Park. The grade eight girls volleyball black team will have games at Grandview Heights against Grandview Heights and Semiamu at 3.30 and 4.30. The grade eight girls volleyball red team have games against Surrey Christian and Fleetwood Park held at Pacific Academy at 3.30 and 4.30. The grade 8 boys football team have a game against Lord's Tweedsmere at Lord Tweedsmere. The JV girls volleyball team are against Sullivan Heights and Lord's Tweedsmere held at Sullivan Heights at 3.30 and 4.30. On Wednesday, October 25th, the senior volleyball girls will have a game against Lord Tweedsmere held at Pacific Academy at 6 p.m. Good luck to the swim team who are headed to the South Fraser's Regional Championships on Thursday, October 26th. On Friday, October 27th, the JV Girls Volleyball team have a tournament at South Delta. And finally, on Saturday, October 28th, the JV Girls team will continue their tournament at South Delta, and the Senior Boys Football team will go against Langley here at Holy Cross. So make sure to show up and cheer them on. Kickoff is at 1. Reminder to check your emails for a newsletter sign up for teachers, students, and parents to be updated on everything athletics. For any sports-related affairs, you'd like to promote on social media or be featured on This Week at HC, please email romano 2024 at mycrusader.net. Make sure to follow HC underscore athletics on Instagram, and we'll, we'll see you next, next week on This Week, week at, at HC Sports. Camp Zine is here for an important message. 
Camp Zine is here with an important message. What's up, Crusaders? My name's Ivanka. And my name's Jasmine. And, and we are part, part of the, the Camp, Camp Zine, Zine team. team. But what is Camp Zine? Good question. Well, Camp Zine is an art magazine that was created to showcase your art. We are opening up submissions again for this year. Any type of art is accepted. Sketches, paintings, digital art, photography, and even things such as baking and nail art. You can submit to our November issue by scanning the QR code on the screen. You can also find it on the door to the art room and the TVs around the school. The due date for submissions is November 25th, and the issue will be coming out on December 4th. We look forward to seeing your art. Thank you. Here's a video from Simply Green. What's up, Holy Cross? I'm Jacob. I'm Caleb. And I'm Jacob L. And welcome back to a second episode of Simply Green brought to you by the Marketing 11 class. What's this QR code for? These QR codes are posted around the school that are linked to a Google form for a chance to win a Tim Hortons gift card. The Google form is a survey where you have to answer questions about where certain waste goes. So you're probably thinking, what is HE Goes Green? Well, let me tell you. HE Goes Green is a movement produced by the Marketing 11 class to promote green growth in our common school and our common community. During last week's episode, we talked about putting our waste in the proper place. But over the course of the week, we found wrong things in the wrong bin. By doing your part and taking time out of your day, you can keep our environment clean. We had to cut this episode short, but make sure to follow us on HG Goes Green on Instagram and HG Goes Green on TikTok for future updates. And stay tuned for next week because we'll have more coming. For anything that you may want to add on to next week's HG News, please email webteam at mycrusader.net. Reminder that our deadline for submission is every Thursday at 3 p.m. Make sure to follow Crusader Connect and all Holy Cross social media accounts to get up to date with all Holy Cross related affairs. That's all for now. Bye, Bye Holy, Holy Cross. Cross! Our hands are open. Okay. <laughs>